What's up guys, it's Aaron Shady here, and welcome back to part 4. Now, if you guys are watching this, then that's because the video uploaded successfully at 12pm Pacific Standard Time on June 7th. So, welcome to part 4, and today we're going to be making a fast place hack and an auto mine hack. So give me one moment to go get something for Swapper back. Where's the program? There it is. Alright, I'm back. So, let's get right into this. So first of all, let's close these. We don't need these open anymore. Alright, so, let's go ahead and make the new class, and let's start off with the fast place. So, of course, like always, extends module, import, public fast place, Okay. Super fast place. Keyword. Underscore. Period. I'm gonna put this to period. Category. Player. So be public. Void on update. And then if this dot get stay. Wrapper dot mc dot right click delay right equals zero import and then this right click delay timer hover over it and change the visibility of it to public just like we did in the last video and it's gonna open up another tab or it should open up another tab and then you just save it it does it for you and then you just save over here And then that does that. And then. Oh! Okay. How about. Public void on disable. And then. Wrapper dot. MC dot. Right. Click delay timer. And set that equal to 6. So let's go ahead and paste this. Maybe. Here. So let's go ahead and test out our new hack. So basically the way the code is written is when you activate it, the right click delay timer is just completely taken off so you can just hold it in fast place. And then when you disable it, it goes back to normal which is 6. It's pretty straightforward. So. Let's get like stone. And let's try like without fast place. Yeah, this is pretty slow, doesn't it? Let's turn it on. There we go. Just spam blocks everywhere. It's all you gotta do, then you can just grief servers this way. Now, I really don't want to remove this by clicking over and over like this. This is gonna be really boring. So, let's go ahead and make the next module. This one's called Auto Mine. It's pretty much kind of the same thing as the auto walk, you just change like a couple of words. You'll see it. You'll see it in action right now. So I'm just gonna cut it really fast. What key should I bind this to? Huh. Maybe let's bind it to apostrophe. Keyboard dot key apostrophe. Let's do apostrophe dot player. So my bad. I just like smacked my microphone. Public void on update. If this dot gets stay wrapper dot mc dot game settings dot key bind attack press is equal to true import the wrapper this disable wrapper dot mc dot game settings dot key bind attack dot press equal to false save that wrong class Let's put that like here. 
Save that and let's go ahead and test it. Hopefully this works. So now we wait for Minecraft to open again. Go back into the world. And now I don't want to remove this by hand. Like so. Activate. And all we do is walk forward. So yeah, we're just going to remove this while I talk to you guys. So, what, like I said in the last video, if you guys want to see anything else other than how to code a Minecraft hat client, you guys can let me know. If you guys want to see me play games or anything, I'm completely fine with that. Because there's only so much you can do with the Minecraft hat client. There's only so far you can go. Well, yeah, I hope you guys also enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more videos like this, let me know in the comments below. Leave a like if you guys like the video. And yeah, I don't know why I went all quiet. But definitely, if you guys like the video, remember to drop a like. It really lets me know that you guys want to see more. Leave in the comments whatever you guys want to see next. And I'll see you guys all in the next video. Goodbye.